Hey guys, Caleb here, your Monday host for a transverse. Uh, this week we're going to be talking about binder care and safety. Um, <clears throat> so, first of all, don't ever bind with tape, rope, uh, bandages, anything like that. Just don't do it. I'd rather you wear, um, a, like, a sports bra, like, a tight sports bra would be way better and than just wear baggy shirts, um, until you can get a binder. And then, um, when you finally do get a binder, make sure you measure and get the right size. Um, there's a reason for the recommended size because you can crush your lungs if it's too tight, um, you can destroy all your chest skin, and it, it just gets, it gets all kinds of fucked up, man, I just, <laughs> just get the right size, um, uh, some advice for bigger men who have bigger chests, I used to be, like, in the E range, um, I use the Tri Top Binder from Underworks. It's like $45, which I know is a little bit more expensive, but they last for years. I've had, um, well, I had worn my last one for like five years, and it was, I mean, it gets stretched out, but sometimes, but if you throw in the dryer for a couple minutes at a time, uh, it goes back. Uh, so, the safety part, right? That's what we're covering. Um, so, binder size. Well, uh, I guess that's really it for the safety. Um, uh, when it comes to, like, washing binders, you should probably wash them at least once a week. I was notorious for not doing that, and it caused a lot of acne. So, make sure you wash it, too. Um, don't dry them. Like I was saying, uh, earlier I said do it a couple minutes at a time. Um, you can't dry them because they're spandex and they'll just shrink. And after they shrink, they don't stretch back. Um, I've never had that happen to me, uh, personally, but I have heard of guys that it did happen to, so, um, let's see, uh, when it comes to binders, I know there's several places now, um, what reigned king back in my day was Underworks and Tea Kingdom, uh, I definitely, I highly recommend, or suggest underworks they're a quality product like you you get what you pay for and they have like an ftm section so that's cool like geared towards us um let's see um want to say I hit all my bullet points so kids bind safe that's my biggest thing that I, I need to get across right now please bind safe like one time I fell asleep in my binder for two hours I couldn't wear it for a month because I couldn't breathe with it on so please be careful don't take it for granted like make sure um, <clears throat> No more than eight hours at a time. When you take your binder off, take big breaths in to like clear your chest because it's been bound all day, man. Like you can't. You just gotta respect your body, um, even if you hate that part of your body. But um, bind safe, please. And uh, that's it for me and my rambles. Uh, <laughs> uh, see you guys next week.